Good morning and welcome to this hearing of the City Council Committee of Transportation. I am Danis Rodriguez, the chair of this committee. Today the committee will be voting on proposed intro 1140-A, sponsored by Council Member Constant, Costa Constantinides in relation to off-hour deliveries at city facilities. Vehicles making off-hour deliveries experience and cause less delays in traffic and can find parking easier than during re regular business hours. This increased efficiency lead to increased savings for businesses and reduce congestion in the city. We must be able to decrease congestion in the city to increase pedestrians and cyclist safety. Its environmental, imp its environmental impact on our city and to begin embracing alternative ways of transportation that will allow the city to run faster and more efficiently than ever before. Proposed intro number 1140-A would require an agency or office designated by the mayor working with the other agency and offices to assess and feasibility, the feasibility of of hours deliveries to city facilities and implement of our deliveries at facilities where it is deemed feasible. The bill will also require the city to study of our deliveries to city facilities and develop a framework for the implementation of such deliveries at city facilities in the central business district, which include part of Manhattan South of 60th Street and at two other highly congested areas in the city. Before I call the vote, I would like to acknowledge that we also have been joined by Council Member Diaz, Miles Cabrera, Ku, Dodge, Espinal, and Levin, and Levin. And I also like to say that we have voted in this bill in a historical moment where in the last few days we saw how hundreds of thousands of, of New Yorkers and visitors, but especially the future, the youth, the students, they took the day to learn in the street, not necessarily in the class, in the climate change march that sent the message loud and clear that even though there's a guy in D.C. who said that climate change was invented by the Chinese, climate change is real, we know Kat Katrina, we know Sandy, we know Maria, we know it's North Stone, and this is the time, again, for that powerful voice or, or youth and students in New York City to resonate there in D.C. so that we can uh, make our nation as it should be the leading one dealing with climate change. And with that... Uh, Councilman Constantini is not here. Uh, I recommend a yes, powerful vote on proposed intro 1140A and as a committee clerk to please uh, call the roll. Matthew DiStefano, committee clerk, committee on transportation, roll call vote on proposed intro 1140A. Chair Rodriguez. that happened in the sea between Puerto Rico and the Dominican Republic, I vote aye. Cabrera. Permission to explain my vote? Yes. Okay, thank you. Uh, I just want to uh, request, uh, Mr. Chair, if we can, in the future, I know, uh, and as I was looking at our... Uh, uh, the explanation of the bill that there is no revenue expenditure is zero, uh, but there is, you know, a survey that is going to be done and feasibility study, environmental, some kind of environmental impact. So there is a cost to the agency. If we could include that in the future, uh, but I vote with a resounding uh, I. I think this is much needed, uh, and um, it will make us a better city, especially uh, regarding environmental impact. And with that, I vote aye. Deutsch. Aye. Espinel. Aye. Ku. Aye. Levin. Aye. Levine. Aye. Miller. Aye. Diaz. By a vote of nine, any affirmative, zero to negative, and no abstentions, the item has been adopted. And we will leave the vote up. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, thanks. So with that, we, the, this hearing is adjourned.